when it comes to exercise and play, artificial turf can provide a field of benefits, including a lower maintenance place to run, practice, and a softer place to land, thanks to the rubber that pads many turfs. But those little black rubber crumbs made of recycled tires are also a source of concern. There is um, data to suggest that the, this product is safe. Uh, but when, we, when we're talking about the safety of our children, um, I think we need to have a little bit extra caution. And for every study that says that there aren't any issues here, there's a study that says that there are issues here. Maple Grove lawmaker Dennis Smith is calling for a two-year moratorium on the construction of any new fields or playgrounds using crumb rubber. Nationwide, it's a controversial topic after health concerns were raised about possible risks from exposure to the recycled tire rubber and potential carcinogens. Temperatures can get up to about 185 degrees. In a legislative hearing, concerns from a St. Thomas professor centered on the heat generated when the black rubber absorbs the sun. I'm not making a value judgment on what kind of fields are better. What I'm here to do is to tell you that the evidence is clear and convincing in the scientific community that these temperatures on these fields can reach unsafe levels. A lobbyist for a tire recycler offered a different perspective. There's a robust body of scientific literature that includes dozens of studies, peer-reviewed academic analysis, and government reports that clearly indicate that recycled rubber is no more dangerous than surrounding soils or other products that are part of our daily lives. There is currently a long-term study underway in California and in conjunction with the federal government that will be completed in 2019 about the effects of crumb rubber.